Well hello there, uh, welcome to Matt's Plot. Today we're down at the kitchen garden and let's have a quick look at how the no dig bed area is doing. So as you can see we're starting on the polytunnel now and we're going to have two beds down there. You can see this bed here, uh, it's about 1.2 metres in width and then the full length 6 metres long and then we see these boards, that's where the other bed's going to be and then there'll be a path straight up the middle. So let's have a closer look, it's just using scaffolding boards and bits of scrap timber that are allowed to hold it in. Uh, it's about what's the depth? It's about eight inches. I think that's the depth of the scaffolding board between seven and eight inches deep. All composted muck. It's been in the heat for about three, four years. Hasn't been turned that much, so it's still a bit clumpy, but it will break down lovely. Full of worms. Uh, there's about two and a half ton I've moved in so far. So they're six meters by 1.2 meters at eight inches deep you do the math it's a lot um, so we'll have two beds in Charles Dowden book he does say anything over six inches uh, deep and on raised beds you don't need to put cardboard down so I'll just put it straight on top of the grass and then when I'm doing the uh, pathway I'll put cardboard down there and about three inches of wood chip and that should be fine hopefully now moving on to the raised beds uh, sorry the, the no dig beds that we've done there are a few little bits of grass popping through but I think that's just where I've not done it properly, I don't think it's a problem with the method. We've planted some salads, so we've got some pak choy in the first two rows and then we'll come back. We've got some little module planted beetroots there, straight into the compost, no messing about. And then we've got some spring onions. And then up at the top, we've got the butternut squash plant and one over on that one as well. We want to see how they grow. Uh, so that's all that's going on over on the no dig area at the moment. As we move on, I'll keep you updated. Thanks very much.